Hi, welcome to the Black Hat Corner. For today's video, we're going to be doing a series on Mass Effect. This is my first video, so try not to be too harsh. So buckle in, grab some snacks, because this is going to be a wild ride. You know Mass Effect. So let's start a new career. Welcome I have to played Alliance this before, military so database. Classified information I know requested. the secrets and stuff and what's going to happen. So if that puts you off of this video, so be it. Secure connection right. confirmed. Secure connection. We're going for Jane Shep. Oh, enter a new ID. Ah. Custom Please female. log in to access your profile. Oh, all right. Oh well, she can be Jane. We got Jane Shepard. Whoop they Okay. Warning: data corruption detected. Please uh -oh. reconstruct profile. All right, let's do Confirm that. Confirm pre-service history. Pre-service history. All right. Spacer colonist or Earthborn? Let's do colonist because that has psychological more of a dramatic profile. backstory. All right. Soul Survivor. Ooh. Right. Confirm military specialization. Soldier. All right. Sentinel. Sniper Confirm rifle. facial identification. Change that appearance. All right. Let's go through. I figured we go through the customization since this is going to be the person that you're going to follow through the entire trilogy, so... Let's change their hair. Alright. Ooh. I don't think I've done that one before. Let's choose a hair color. Ooh. Pretty in pink. I think it has to be that. Let's do pretty in pink. All right. Okay. Let's just cycle presets real quick, though. Fix the hair later. Ooh, I like her. All right. Now let's just change the hair real quick. Change it to pretty in pink. I think we'll keep the lipstick color. Ooh, let's add some eyeshadow. What should it be? Ooh. Kind of like that. All right. Now let's get the scars going. Ain't got it. Ain't a bad bitch without scars. All right. Gonna bleep that out. Or maybe not. I don't know. I don't know how they like their things done. YouTube. Okay. This is going to be the character we follow through this entire trilogy. So, I hope you like him, because I know I do. Profile reconstruction complete. All right. Identification confirmed. We're going to do that casual, please. Um, subtitles on autosave. Tutorial, so confirm. Let's get into it, Mike. Okay. Ain't that a big blue spear? Well, what about Shepard? She grew up in the colonies. Indeed. She knows how tough life can be out there. Her parents were killed when slavers attacked Mindwar. Very sad time. She saw her whole unit die on a cruise. She could have some serious emotional scars. Yep. Good answer. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. Mm -hmm. I'll make the call. Indeed you will. Think about it is three three times I'm saving this damn galaxy. Three times They 
College. Title card. The Arcturus Prime relays in range. Initiating transmission sequence. Commander? We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot. Acquiring approach vector. Indeed it is. All stations secure for transit. on the bridge. Oh yeah. Hitting the relay in three, two, one. <laughs> Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500K. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having him on board. Call me paranoid. You are paranoid. paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Joker, do not dare talk about Turians that way. The only reason... You know what? Never mind. I'm not going to get into Mass Effect Andromeda. And they don't send specters on shakedown runs. So there's more going on here than the captain's letting up. Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach the Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's right already there. here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. Out it. You get that, Commander? He sounds angry. Something must have gone wrong with the mission. <laughs> Captain always sounds like that when he's talking to me. Can't possibly imagine why. I... All right. We're in. Look at this. Yes. If we're getting dragged. If you can't tell, I have a soft spot for Turians. Nihilus so, about let's get in here. Hello, Nihilus. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. What about? Please do. I'm interested in this world we're going to, Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Beyond beautiful. They say it's a paradise. Yes, a paradise. Serene, tranquil, safe. Eden Prime has become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Do you know something? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. Obviously. I figured there was something you weren't telling us. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. Mm. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Protheon. Ooh. Protheon. 
Well, that sounds like my kind of alien. Shit. All right. What are the details? What else can you tell me? This is Big Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. Tell but Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. It never hurts to have a few extra hands on board. The beacon is not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live, a particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden Prime. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Get down! out after that no calm traffic at all it just goes dead there's nothing reverse and hold of 38.5 status report 17 minutes out captain no other alliance ships in the area take us in joker fast and quiet this mission just got a lot more complicated a small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention it's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. All right. Where we dropping, boy? <laughs> Ignore the comment, please. I don't play Fortnite. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you're coming with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Good. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! We are approaching drop point two. What do you think happened? Okay. Jenkins, 
No! see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete, but I need you to stay focused. Aye, aye, man. Right. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, ma'am? Yes, I am, you xenophobic bitch. Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. Think the Geth haven't they been are. seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your come help, on. Williams. Aye, aye, ma'am. It's time for payback. All right. Move out! Bit some unbridled rage we might have to check out later, but you know what? Use it now. It might as well. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Okay. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Okay, well then let's go, let's go look there, I. Eh? Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Oh, God. 
They're still alive. What did the Geth do to Aren't them? Aren't they, though? Sort of like a zombie situation. Let's see. I'd rather quit my pistol for these guys. Thank the Maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you, I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Okay. Goodbye. I hope you survive. Ooh, what's in here? Ooh, a crate. Onward to the spaceport. Ba -na 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 -na. Ah, Nihilus, we hardly knew ye. Seren. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Nihilus, no! You're the second person to die in this one mission. What is that? Off in the distance. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I am sorry, I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Tell me what happened. I need to know how Nihilus died. The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I, I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. 
Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. All right, let's go then. We need to find Have that beacon nice before day, it's too I late. Guess. Take the cargo train. Thanks, That's where the info. other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. Yes, indeed you do. Okay. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Not if I can help it. You know, destroying this place is quite nice, actually, without, you know, the bodies and, you know, burning buildings. We have a little brawl, mate. I bet I can pop your head in the fist. I didn't sound it. No, oh, they just go on from that. Alright. Demolition charges! The Geth must have planted them! Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down!
investigate the Prothean Beacon. To the beacon! Like an ice Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. I'll just have the Something magic must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. I'm all like Siren does, actually. Damn it, Kaiden. I don't think we have the Prothean Beacon anymore. Well, we have it, but... It's, yeah. Oh, yeah. But there's so many ass shots. We identified the ship that touched down on Eden Prime. The, the Normandy. Normandy. A human lie. alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. That was the scene. Doctor? Dr. Chakwas. I think she's waking up. You think? You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? How do you think? Like shit. Minor throbbing. Nothing serious. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Oh, damn. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. Caden, you dumbass, but don't blame yourself. You had no way to know what would happen. You don't get close Actually, to alien technology. Actually, we don't even technology. know if that's what set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. And the blast knocked you cold. Williams and I had to carry you back here to the ship. Thank you. I appreciate it. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal beta waves. I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death, destruction... Nothing's really clear. I better add this to my report. It may... Oh. Captain Anderson. Oh, why don't you come? How's our oh, exo holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the commander's going to be fine. Thank okay. you. Glad to hear it. You're right, Joel. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Hmm. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Did we leave Gunnery Chief Williams back on Eden Prime? I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Good. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. Lieutenant Elenko agrees fault, with you. A good soldier. That's why I added her to our crew. Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Gether invading. 
The Council's going to want answers. Yep, they are. I didn't do anything wrong, Captain. Hopefully the Council can see that. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren. That other Turian. Mm -hmm. Saren's a specter. One of the best. A living legend. But if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous. And he hates humans. He didn't come to Eden Prime because he hates humans. You're right. Saren has mm. allied himself with the Gith. I don't know how. I don't know why. But it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Well, I did see in my head that, you know, ships were flying in, everyone was dying. So maybe we could we could put that as proof. So, I hey, we got some proof there at least, instead of, you know, like, air, but there we are. Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? A warning. I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. <sighs> what are we gonna tell them? I had a bad dream? We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Sarah took it. But I know Sarah. I know his reputation is politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. Too raw, too raw. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the Council on our side. We prove Saren's gone rogue, and the Council will revoke his specter status. Mm -hmm. I'll contact the Ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the Council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be her. getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Okay, well. Alright. I'd say this is where we're going to end part one. It's <laughs> videos are start, already starting to get quite long, so I hope you like the video, and we'll come back to see part two of our Mass Effect Trilogy playthrough. So have a good day, and good night.